The Safari Land Group presents Second Chance Body Armor, Male Sizing with Sizing Vest Instructions. In this video, you will find step-by-step -step instructions on how to size Second Chance Male Body Armor using the Sizing Vest. Please have your sizing instructions available as we will be referring to them throughout this video. Prior to sizing, make sure that the officer is wearing their normal duty uniform. You will need the following tools to measure the officer accurately a soft measuring tape, an armless chair, sizing vests, and the appropriate sizing forms. While sizing, remember that communication is key. Speak with the officer to determine their main concerns. Step 1. Total Girth Measurement Measure the waist at its widest circumference between the chest and the top of the duty belt. Choose a desired overlap and refer to the overlap calculation chart. Add the value obtained for the chosen overlap with the girth measurement to find the total girth measurement. For example, if the girth measurement is 36 inches and a 1 inch overlap is desired, we would add 3 inches to get a total girth measurement of 39 inches. Step 2. Determine front and back panel width. Use the total girth measurement obtained earlier and divide it by 2 to find your front and back panel width. In our example, a 39 inch total girth divided by 2 would result in 19.5 inches rounded up to 20 inches. Use this measurement and refer to the panel width chart on the sizing form. Have the officer put on the sizing vest corresponding to the calculated front and back panel widths. Fill out the size traveler with the found size. In our example, we would have a front and back panel width of 20 inches. Step 3. Determine front and back panel length. For front length, locate the front tab located at the bottom of the sizing vest. Pull down the tab and find where the tab and the duty belt meet. Note the corresponding marking and refer to the front length sizing chart. In our example, we have a front length of 16 inches. Record the size on the size traveler. For back length, locate the back tab on the bottom of the sizing vest. Pull down the tab and find where the tab and the duty belt meet. Note the corresponding marking and refer to the back length sizing chart. In our example, this would be 15 inches. Record this size on the size traveler. Step 4. Adhere all straps. Upon identifying the front and back panel sizes, adhere the appropriate panels to the torso by securing the shoulder and waist straps while the officer is standing. Have the officer sit and adjust the shoulder and waist straps so they provide a comfortable fit. Step 5. Evaluate the overlap. With the vest on, verify there is an even amount of coverage on the right and left side of the officer. For example, if there is a 1 inch overlap on the right side, there should also be a 1 inch overlap on the left side. Step 6. Verify measurements and submit a size. Be sure the officer is comfortable with the coverage of the vest panel size determined by your measurements. They should also be informed how the length and overlap of the armor will interact with their other equipment. Once you have determined a size, record the size and submit the sizing form to Safari Land's Customer Care Center. If you have any questions, contact our customer service at 800-347-1200.